Welcome to DeLand in West Volusia County. A big thank you to the West Volusia Visitor Bureau for hosting us during our stay. The Courtyard by Marriott offers a state-of-the-art fitness center, complimentary Wi-Fi, a restful night's sleep in their plush bedding, the bistro for a quick meal on the go, and a refreshing place to swim in the outdoor pool. This innovative hotel is beautifully appointed and perfectly located. It's also within walking distance to all of the top local attractions. Look at the rainbow flag. For a romantic and delicious dining experience, head to Cress Restaurant. Cress is a critically acclaimed restaurant in historic downtown DeLand, serving globally inspired food with a determined emphasis on quality local and sustainable ingredients. If you're looking for a simple on-the-go breakfast, check out New York Bagels and Deli. They even have rainbow bagels. I found a rainbow bagel in the land. Mm. Tastes just like a plain bagel, but colorful. For a diner experience with a little twist, check out C's Waffles. I had the waffle breakfast sandwich and it was oh so delectable. Sweet, salty, savory, and a little bit of crunch made for the perfect breakfast bite. So we are off to the old Spanish sugar mill for breakfast. You ready to make your own pancakes? Ready. <laughs> I think she needs a little more coffee first. The old Spanish sugar mill in De Leon Springs, outside of DeLand, was by far our favorite breakfast spot. Constructed in 1570, the mill was originally used to crush sugarcane using the power from the flowing spring. In 1961, Peter Schwartz restored the mill and made the area his home. His daughter, Patty Schwartz, owns and manages the restaurant. Each table is equipped with its very own commercial grade griddle, where you are the star line cook. Make some pancakes, enjoy conversation, and watch the beautiful nature scene outside the window. When you're done, enjoy many of the park activities nearby. Rent a paddle boat, canoe or kayak, or just take a hike around the floodplain hammock, half mile paved nature trail. Bar is one of the original craft beer bars in Volusia County in Central Florida. It's received many awards and specializes in craft beer from Florida, across the U.S. and the world. I got it in the basket. <laughs> Abby offers a unique menu of upscale bar fare that is prepared fresh daily. William Pride was uh, founded in 2015 after um, it came out of the Pulse tragedy. Um, a bunch of people in town got together and it actually started as just a group on Facebook um, supporting the LGBTQ community in town and eventually it grew into something more and we're about to celebrate our seven year anniversary. We just had our Love is Love Festival. It was just over a week-long festival. We have some events coming up in June for our anniversary and for Pride Month. We have drag night every Tuesday night at Cafe Da Vinci with drag performers. We have drag bingo, which we are having tonight.
1952. Are you saying I pull all the wrong balls? It has been the story of my life. <laughs> Margaret, you ready for an eco tour? Sure. <laughs> if you need a little nature, then take an eco tour on the St. John's River. Right outside of DeLand, St. John's River Eco Tours is located in DeBerry, Florida. The tour company operates several boat tours daily, exploring the river, observing the wildlife, and experiencing a section of the St. John's that is little changed from the days when early explorers visited these enchanting waters. Whether you're a bird watcher, a fan of alligators or manatees, a nature photographer, or are just looking for something a little different, St. John's Riverboat Tours may be just what you're looking for. After you're done with your eco tour, stop at the Swamp House for some steamed shrimp and a delicious Gator Bite sandwich wrap. Ready for the farmer's market? Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> the Deland Artisan Alley Farmers Market is a vibrant marketplace with over 80 vendors and farmers. It takes place every Friday evening from 6 to 9 p.m. Energy. We're about to heal ourselves in this pretty look at that. Right here at the farmer's market in Zoland. Do you want one? No. You got, you got your healing energy right there, right? Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. Yeah. We just happened to be in town for the Deland Craft Beer Festival. And boy, did we get our drink on. Although I'm not the biggest beer drinker, my wife, Margaret, is. She sampled beers from around the state of Florida and definitely found a few new favorites. As long as it doesn't taste like a fish, While she continued sampling, I checked out some shopping. The Land's Main Street, also known as Woodland Boulevard, is packed full of places to shop, eat, unwind, and grab a drink. Up so guys. If I tried to do that position, I'd probably kill myself. Yeah, good on her though. No visit to DeLand is complete without a Stetson Mansion tour. The 1886 Stetson Mansion is Florida's most historic home and the largest, grandest, most innovative home ever built in Florida before 1900. The mansion is most popular during the holiday season. Christmas tours are offered from November 1st to January 22nd. So we are standing in front of the Stetson Mansion right here in DeLand. We're about to go in for a tour. We are not allowed to bring cameras or video equipment with us, so we'll have to see you on the flip side. You ready? Let's go. You gonna buy a mansion like this for me? 
Don't miss this hidden treasure in West Volusia County. One of the coolest things about this property is it was also the first home in Florida designed and constructed with Edison electricity, steam heat, indoor plumbing, and a call bell system. Wow, what an incredible tour of the Stetson Mansion. The history that is in here is phenomenal. Edison and Tiffany and famous people like that have had touches in this house that you have to see to believe. And we love the fact that this house is owned by two incredibly talented men. Come check it out when you're in Deland. Make sure to subscribe to Outcoast TV and join us next time as we go out on the coast with Outcoast TV.